Okay, so one of the first things we need to do is remove the wheel. 19 millimeter, remove your lug nuts. <laughs> Remove your wheel. Okay, so our next step, we're gonna spray down this area right here and this area right here with some penetrant. Nice. Next, we're gonna loosen this tie rod jam nut. Next, we're gonna remove the outer tie rod nut. Next, we're gonna bonk right here on the knuckle with our hammer. You wanna be careful not to damage the threads. Now it's time to unscrew the outer tie rod end from the inner tie rod. We're gonna count the turns. One, two, and so on. 21. Just gonna use some locking pliers and hold on to the inner tie rod so it can't spin. Twenty-two millimeter socket and remove this jam nut. Tiny bit of copper never sees. We've got our brand new jam nut. Take your tie rod end. We're gonna put it on. We're gonna give it 21 turns. One, two, three, four, and so on. Okay. Put your outer tie rod end stud through the knuckle. Put your nut on there. We're gonna snug it up. Tighten this up. Now we're gonna torque this nut to 55 foot-pounds. That's torqued. You wanna make sure that the slot's lined up with the hole inside the tie rod end. Make sure you put through a cotter pin to lock it in. Take your new lock and cotter pin. Slide it through. And peen it over so there's no way that this nut can come off of here. Let's get our wheel up on here. Lug nut on there. Let's torque these to 100 foot pounds. Torqued. 